Welcome to the American Hospital Association. In this video, we will walk through how to access the AHA Digital Pulse. In order to access the AHA Digital Pulse, you will need to have an account and confirm that it is linked to your organization. To start, go to aha.org and click the Register button on the top of the screen. Then, click the Create an Account button and enter your email address. If you are affiliated with an AHA member organization, please use your business email address and then click Submit. On the next page, a list of organizations will display. Click the Link My User Account to This Org next to your organization. If you don't see your organization on the list, click Search for Your Organization by Zip Code located near the bottom and follow the instructions provided. After you've clicked the button, your organization's address will auto populate in the Address Information section. You'll fill out your first name, your last name, and your title, and any other information that might be relevant, and then you'll create a password at the bottom of the page. Your password must contain eight characters, at least one number, and one uppercase letter. It can't have any symbols. Once you confirm your password, you'll click Create an Account. And after you have created the account, please return to the home page and log in using your new credentials. Once I'm logged in, I can search for the Digital Pulse tool, and I'll see some results. Should be the first result here, AHA Digital Pulse. And then I'm taken to a page where I can learn more about the tool and log in using my new credentials. We'll first set up an account, then step through a COVID-19 pulse, and finally, we'll explore resources available to help you and your teams in this work. So after coming from aha.org, we'll do a quick setup for single sign-on so you can quickly and easily move between resources. I'm gonna validate my email here. When I do that, I'll be taken back into the platform, and we'll go through a quick onboarding so that we can learn how to tailor the platform to you and the things that you are interested in. Fill out some basic information. And then for these purposes, I'm just gonna select these top five interests. You can pick any five or, or more that you're interested in to tailor the platform for you. 